India has finally reacted on the disturbing incident of a drunk passenger urinating on an elderly woman on its New York to Delhi business class uh, flight last year. Now, calling the behavior unacceptable and undignified, the airline has banned the passenger for 30 days and has reported the incident to DGCA for further action. Besides, the airline has even constituted an internal committee to probe lapses on part of its crew after claims that the victim allegedly received zero help from the cabin crew on board. Now, as for the complainant, Air India apparently took cognizance only after the elderly woman wrote to the Air India chairman about the issue. We do understand on one hand, of course, the action being that Air India has given a statement. On the other hand, we're learning that, uh, you know, the person in question, the passenger in question has been banned for 30 days. But obviously, it raises questions, is 30 days enough? But also talk to us about what exactly Air India has said and this internal committee that has now been uh, formed to check into this particular uh, incident that has taken place. See, definitely, you know, uh, not late, then better. You know, the, at least a statement has been issued now. And uh, the statement reads out that Air India has taken a very serious note of this incident. And they have lodged a police complaint on their own against the unruly passenger and are cooperating with the investigating agency. So definitely an FIR will be registered in near future against the unruly passenger. One. Second, importantly, an internal inquiry has been constituted against those cabin crew who were present at that point and could not give an immediate redressal to the incident that took place. And definitely, the, uh, the, the statement also mentioned that they are in constant touch with the fellow passenger, uh, the aggrieved passenger, and are communicating and uh, the, all the investigation that is going on, in fact, are in touch with them. But definitely there are certain questions that has been raised. Why that incident couldn't get highlighted at that given point of time? What were the cabin crews doing? Uh, were they, uh, uh, I mean, were, was there any deregulation of duty at that given point of time? Or they noticed such incident and, you know, they didn't took the necessary action that should have been initiated at that given point of time. And this all coming out after that lady writes to a superior authority. Definitely questions are being raised. Now we can see Air India is in action. They have come out with a statement. They are cooperating. In fact, the 30-day ban that has been initiated definitely is something that they can, under the rules, give. They cannot extend that. And what is more important, they have notified and explained the entire detail to the DGCA for the further action and DGC has also initiated a probe into it. If you like this video, then like, share and subscribe to Mirror Now.